Hi everyone, for today's video I'm going to talk about Spy Family Code White. Spy Family Code White is a 2023 Japanese animated spy action comedy film based on the manga and anime of the same name. Let me just say, I was excited to hear about this one, as I'm a huge fan of the show. And you can tell, given on how many times I used this Anya green screen, and a couple times I used Lloyd. However, the film was only available for Japan when it was first released, and I had to wait fucking months just for it to be released here in the US. So when it finally came here, I bought my ticket in a fucking heartbeat. So for those who don't know, the show is basically about a spy who has to build a fake family in order to complete a mission involving a high-ranking politician. And along with his mission are his daughter, Anya, who is a telepath, however the parents don't know this. And there's his quote-unquote waifu, Yor, who is a skilled assassin. Oh, and there's also the dog, Bond who can see into the future. Together they make one hell of a misfit family, but god damn it's fucking entertaining. So without further ado, let's talk about the movie itself. So basically, after receiving some bad news about his current mission, my boy Lloyd decides to help Anya in a competition in the school. And so, they have to travel in order to find a certain item, which I cannot say because it's classified. However, during their travels, they set off a chain of events that could potentially put world peace at risk. And that's as much as I can reveal without spoiling too much because this movie is worth a watch. Again, the animation is spectacular here, as in certain parts, the animation shifts depending on the situation and or characters. Also, the action scenes are badass as fuck, as we get to see both Lloyd and Yor have their time to shine in whooping ass. And the comedy is fun as hell, as we get to see each and every one of the characters in funny situations and having their time to shine in comedic roles. You may be wondering, do you need to see the show itself to understand what the hell is going on? Well, kinda. The film itself basically recaps what you need to know about the characters and their situation. But personally, I would totally recommend watching this series as certain scenes do feel more impactful knowing what goes on in the series. But I will admit, the film itself does serve as a spin-off series, as I personally feel like it doesn't really impact that much in the anime series itself. It doesn't do it as, let's say, Demon Slayer does. So overall, this movie is one hell of an exciting time, and believe me, you enjoy watching it. I'll give the film 4.5 onions out of 5. And that was the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos just like this. Oh, and if you like like my work, support the channel at Ko-Fi. There you can help support me as I make these videos and keep the channel afloat. And you can drop suggestions for any future projects you want to see. And you get to have your names in the credits. And if you do support me, I thank you very much. And I appreciate it very much. So stay safe, take care, and goodbye. <laughs>